arrived, the only way a sane person should for a weekend in Vegas. I'm talking about solo people. Abigail pissed on my iPad for no reason. Our marriage counselor suggested that we have a trial separation for one month, which meant I was free to do whatever I wanted, starting right now. How you doing? Doing very well, sir. Thank you. My name is Ward. Cedric Ward. I'm staying in the uh... Constantine Villa. Welcome, Mr. Ward. We've been expecting you. Your dedicated concierge is awaiting you inside. All right, well, listen, I'm gonna need you to dedicate yourself to something. See this car right here? It's a rental. And I passed on the insurance because they wanted me to pay the extra five. I'm not talking about dollars. I'm talking about hundred. So what I need you to do is watch this call of your life depend on it. Can you do that for me? Are you ready? Come on. Are you ready? Let go. Are you ready? It's on. It's on. It's on. Let's take the mountain. Let's take the hill. Hello. Let's walk the river. This is what I'm talking about. Welcome to Caesar's Palace, Mr. Ward. I'm Vanessa, here to accommodate your every need during your stay with us. Well, I got a lot of needs, so let's get to accommodate. <laughs> <laughs> I understand you're part of the Hanover Hall wedding party. You're looking at the best man. Oh. I'm gonna hook it up. In my opinion, the Constantine Villa is the most elegant suite in the entire hotel. Were they able to put the sugar pole in the room? Because I'm doing like a little after party, after bachelor party, it's like an after after party. Unfortunately not. Damn it. But your personal butler, Declan, can take care of your other needs. My, my personal butler? I didn't, I didn't pay for no butler. It's on the house. Well, I like this house. <laughs> we aim to please. Well, you have succeeded. Just sign here for your balance and incidentals. I'll take you upstairs for a personal tour of your villa. Private tour? Wow, OK. This is pretty standard, right? You should read it. Nah, nah say the same stuff. <laughs> been to one hotel, been to a moment. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I'm waiting on you. Oh, Vanessa. Cedric, hey, what up, man? Hey, hey. man. So, up? Whoa, wait a minute. Whoa. Hey, man. Hey. Oh, hold up, hold up. Let me get this right. Gail let you leave the house and come to Vegas by yourself. Hey, don't you start with me, Zeke. Elon, I know she is. Gail, where you at? <laughs> Zeke, look at me right now. You look amazing. It looks good, right? Amazing. It's H&M. Yeah, I'm I'm not. Not. Hey, I want to introduce you to my new friend, Vanessa. <laughs> Zeke the freak? Vanessa. You son of a bitch. Oh! oh. 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 What the hell? Oh. What are you doing? Where's my passport? I don't have your damn passport! What's wrong with you? Zeke, I thought you were going to join us. Excuse me. Miss Martinez, I am shocked and appalled in my office immediately. Hey, man, chill out. Watch your back. Thank you, Zeke. Because I had that in the bag. That was about to get booked. She was supposed to give me a tour, sir. I will give you your personalized private tour of the villa. Well, I don't want to be rude, but you can keep that shit. I want Vanessa. I don't need your tour. So look at my face. I'm in the con I'm in the Constantine. The Constantine. 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 I, I, I can't talk to you right now. Are you okay? Your baggage is going to catch up to you, man. Maya, are you all right? Oh, you got to be strong. I get it. Did she go this way? Vanessa! Cedric! Hey! <laughs> The whole crew was back together. Without even realizing it, the men and the women had divided themselves into opposing teams. Nah, look, up, we both got on green shirts. We both got blue eyes. It was a sign of things to come. Let's go get a drink. Man. Please. You could really clear a room out, Bennett. But tell me, what are we doing tonight? No, no, yeah. no. I want to go see Jersey Boys. We're not going to see no damn Jersey Boys, Bennett. Why not? I mean, why not? Because we're men. We're at a bachelor party in Vegas. We're here to make bad decisions and regret them the next day. True. Story of your life, right, Z? I say we take a vote. Bennett, we're not taking a vote. Okay, you know what? I want to talk to everybody before we all start power tripping, okay? Understand that Michael had the opportunity to choose anybody standing here to be his best man. I want y'all to remember that he chose me. You know why? Because I'm the best man with the plan. I didn't want to drop that ball on y'all, but y'all didn't leave me a choice. Now I'm the bad guy. So I've been giving this a lot of thought. I want you to be my best man. Me? No, said actually, I was talking to Don. No, listen, don't say nothing right now, man. Like, I knew you and I had a connection, but this is crazy. Let me tell you something. This means so much to me. I'm not going to let you down. Let me tell you something. I'm going to be the best, best man in the history of all best men. I've always wanted to be a best man. You going to give me that opportunity? We came here to golf, and now you going to give me this blessing? I got I to gotta go to the bathroom, Dom. This is this little light of mine. I'm going to you made the right choice. All right, couples, listen up. Come on, put on pepper and stuff. Listen up, people, you got exactly one hour to go settle into your room and say your goodbyes. Because for the next 24 hours, the boys are going to be with the and boys. And the girls with the girls. Tomorrow, you can all go back to that miserable and sexless existence that is marriage. No offense, Mike. Well, you got to worry about us. We're going to be happy and sexy. <laughs> you better treasure that. OK. What, Cal? No, not now. Let me tell you something, Mike. 
Truth is, Gail and I were both happy and sexy for 22 years. See, there you go. And then after that, we met each other. That ship sailed. Come on, baby, we only got Listen, an hour. Before y'all go, listen to me. Real quick, guys, let's discuss meeting points. The teams were chosen, the players were ready, and it was time for the pregame warm up. Everybody else today, room, I don't know where mine is. In basketball, you have to know what kind of offense you're running. But no matter what it is, the goal is to outscore your opponent. The Constantine Villa, all 12,000 square feet of it. The ultimate bachelor party pack. <laughs> yeah, I had definitely scored first. Your key, sir. Oh, right, right. If there's anything else you need, your personal butler, Declan, is here to serve you. OK. Well, thank you, Marcel Haffer. 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 Marcel will work just fine. Thank I, you. I, I call you Imach. Thank you. <laughs> Declan. Morning, sir. I trust everything is up to your standard, sir. Now, I understand that you um, made an inquiry about making some structural changes to your suite, Mr. Ward. Oh, you got the bowls! Yes! A certain member of a um, certain royal family left more behind than just memories. <laughs> Yes, you can almost smell the aristocratic DNA from here. I don't, I don't know what that means. Well, it doesn't matter. <laughs> now, I shall be next door, so if you need anything, just press number one on your keypad. <laughs> right. Hey, 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 let me tip you, man. No, sir, I couldn't. No, please, stop. People don't think black people I tip. do this for the love of the no, job. Well, thank one, you very much. Two, that would be lovely. Well, I was going to give it all to you. I was going to give you a certain amount. So that's, I think thank you, sir. No, thank you. Thank you. No, the tipper said, OK, you're welcome. You gone? The race was on. No matter what Lauren had planned for the bachelorette party, it didn't matter because she was already behind. Declan, can you 